This is why you need to get to know other notaries and make connections. So today I had two notary jobs that required another notary services just because I don't provide it or I don't have time to provide it. Um, and those services were an apostille. Uh, so I had a notary uh, that I've been working with come out and do an apostille. Um, so I did the notary, uh, the acknowledgement on the special power of attorney, and then I'm paying subcontracting another notary to go and drive out to the state, uh, and complete the apostille and then mail it back to the client. So, um, for that total, I got $450. Um, I did the notary. I'm paying the notary a certain percentage for the, uh, apostille, but that's how you build connections. That same notary also got a second job from me today, which was um, because I'm renewing my uh, fingerprinting in California. Uh, in order to give fingerprints, you have to be fingerprinted and have a certificate. So I'm renewing it right now, having her back from the state. So I needed another notary because I have a recurring client um, that gets them done like every month. And so I paid that notary to do two fingerprint cards. He got $70 just for those two fingerprints. And then I did the uh, like seven signatures, seven notary forms. So we both were there completing it for the doctor. Um, and that's how you build connections. That's how you work together. I'm putting money in other people's pockets. I'm getting things done. Um, and I also get to write that off as an expense because it's under my LLC and I'm paying a subcontractor.